Good morning. Well, it's most El Horseshoe today, so uh, it's fairly warm, although quite high cloud. Um, so we're going up Doorhead, up onto Red Pike, and then we'll follow the ridge along to Pillar, and then come back down Blacktail Pass. So it's uh, yeah, the wind has dropped. It's really high winds yesterday. Um, really making the cottage windows rattle a little bit. So no run yesterday, just a low level walk. But the wind has died down for now. I'm sure it'll there'll be a breeze up the top. But um, so yeah, obviously the day before yesterday I was up Red Pike with Tiggy. So it'll be quite nice to see it not in the cloud. But looking forward to this. It's a, it's a lovely run. So here we are looking at today's run in all its glorious entirety. So we're going straight up there, which will be a hands and feet job, or with, oh, with the poles anyway. And then Red Pike, Windy Gap, Pillar, and then into the gap there in Black Sail, and then the path all the way back along there. Fabulous! And at the moment, no cloud on Pillar. Which is amazing, because half the time I do it, there's just a little cap of cloud on there. So I never get to see anything, so hopefully we'll get a bit of a view. So we're just starting the climb. So just come from down there. Well, just come from up there. And we're going, going straight up there. Which I know won't look that, look that steep on camera, but it's very steep. It'll be uh, hands on the lower handles and possibly even hands on the floor by the time we get that bit. All good. Get the heart pumping and the lungs working hard. What a view! Got to be a bit careful turning around though, I don't want to go back down. <laughs> Not intentionally anyway. Well, here we are up on the top. That's Red Pike just ahead. Pillar over there, which is where I'm heading. Looking down to the coast, straight down to the valley. Beautiful. It's not that warm up here. The breeze isn't that strong, but it does have a little bite to it, I have to say. So if I do uh, stop for a bit of snackage at some point, I think the jacket will have to go on. Here we are, top of the red bike. Let's see, touch the top of the can. Quite steep down there. Ooh. But a good view all around. So we're heading that way, all along the ridge and then down. Fabulous. I have to say that wind is really chilly. I might actually 
my arms aren't too bad as I'm really long, but uh, I might actually have to put some little gloves on because the hands are very cold. One windy gap, and it certainly is windy. So was Dale head that side, and the Dale that side. <laughs> and I'm going up there. Here we are, We're at the top of pillar, pillar on pillar. Look at the view. It's a tad nippy though, so I'm not going to hang about up here, I'm going to drop down a bit. If it warms a smidge I'll stop and have a bit of snackage, otherwise I'll just pull straight down. One day I'll come up onto Pillar and it'll be warm. <laughs> it'll be both warm and out of the cloud. I've got the out of the cloud today. But not the warm. I can have a harness to pass like that. Oh, there's a chilly wind whistling up from Wasdale. I'm on the descent now, so um, every step will probably be getting warmer. <laughs> and you can see where I've just been. So I came up from Mosdale, up Door Head, over Red Pike, and then just coming down off Pillar, and we're heading that way. And very nice too. It was a very quick snackage break. And then off we get going. Generate a bit of heat. This little scramble down the steep stuff. We're just going to get to Black Sail and then we go down the pass. It's looking quite busy actually. I do love the downhill from uh, Pillar down to Black Sail. It's, uh, it's a lovely run. There's uh, some really nice technical bits, so some scrabble and you know, a little bit of craggy stuff. And then there's kind of the more smoother paths with little you know, rocks about that you've got to just watch yourself on. And some nice grassy bits. It's, uh, and obviously the craggy bits are not, you know, nice and steep and you lose a fair bit very quickly and then you got some little gentle downhills on the path. It's, uh, it's a lovely little route. I can highly recommend it. Here we are, on Black Sail Pass. Oh, I see it almost down, back out of the bottom of Rosedale. It doesn't take long to lose all that altitude. Uh, just on the kind of zigzag path now. One guy just went, I was down there. Just went razzing past me on the mountain bike. Oh, that's brave. I wouldn't be cycling anyway down here. <laughs> but, uh, so look, you can already feel the temperature difference. Now we've dropped the altitude. It's actually pretty warm down here. Hiya. 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 Stream block crossing. 
no raging waters today, which makes a nice change. A little bit of rough path. Just on this top section. It's got a little bit of paving going on as well. Which as ever, I can understand the need for it because the path erosion, totally. And it's all right going uphill, but when you're coming down, well, it takes a little bit of this smaller gravel to get onto those steps. It's like a nice rink. But it adds to the fun. <laughs> Sunshine, look. What's this all about? Did a good job about four hours ago. I put some sun lotion on. 